Hey everybody, this is Anthony from Sunny Creates. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, so today I thought I would uh, share this with you. I made it, it was inspired by um, a, a, a Pinterest um, idea. Uh, well, a Pinterest post and I just thought it was so super cute. I just had to make it. Uh, so I thought I'll take you through the process. Um, I honestly can't remember who whose uh, pin it was but uh, um, you know I, I, I sometimes uh, pin these things and then I look through them and then I get the idea and I was like okay I need to make something like this so I can't remember I, I do apologize if I find the pin I will uh, put it down right so this is it and uh, it is uh, I've used um, what is this oh yes I wanted to show you what I used so you know um, so I keep a whole lot of these um, pro neutral cereal boxes okay and then I cut my tags down <coughs> uh, to seven and a half by 15 centimeters uh, so I don't cut all of them to the same ones but I cut the majority to this size and then whatever's left I play around with the sizes after that but I think I showed you this already I showed this to you so you can see um, sometimes I will cut something that looks like this with the extras or whatever okay so I've done that and then what I've actually done is I've backed it on the, uh, this side uh, with some coffee dyed paper and what I normally do is if I print on one side of the coffee dyed paper I mean sorry on of the printer paper I coffee dye the other side and I use it for stuff like this because you don't need double sided to be plain uh, so I will use it to back that up there uh, for example and that is how I kind of recycle then uh, these images uh, so, and then I backed it with uh, music paper I might also use some um, book page I don't know I'll see um, this image here is a bought image I can't remember because I bought two. I bought one from Artie Mace and I bought one from Gecko Gals. And I just cut them up and I put them in a, you know, my containers. I don't know whose this is, uh, but they are, they are, you know, if you look at certain places and certain sites or whatever, you'll find some freebies to use in your personal work. Um, this year is from Graphics Fairy and the one that's on the inside is from, um, oh, um shabby dabby doodah okay and then i've got a um 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 what is this a ball pin over here and i've got a um bread a tiny little bread there got two buttons over here i've made some um uh well it, it is a circle as you can see i use that to punch it out with and i had this here and i just stamped on it to punch out okay uh, and I've got that thing. I've got a, uh, 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 eyelet in there and I've got some coffee dyed, uh, a ribbon in here, uh, material, and you can use, um, seam binding, uh, or sari silk. And then I've just put two buttons over there, like, uh, ivory kind of buttons. And I simply absolutely adore this project. Let's get going. I don't know how many I'm going to be able to make. I took out for two. Um, I am really rushing over here to get this done. So let's see if I can make the two. So I've got some, uh, uh, I back the, back that side, the back side, but I didn't back the front. Okay, so let's see what we can do. Yeah, so sorry, I do sound rushed. I know that. I'm trying to get this video done like in in quick you know a quick amount of time because it does take uh some time to you know get all the page uh, um, i think the, the 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 most work over here was prepping the stuff for the thing uh video so now what i'm going to do over here is uh, you know and can you keep all these things here hey well, uh, next year when i come back i'm going to show you what i do there here now also now i'm looking at it i need to cut off probably this edge over here if i want to make a coffee dyed one oh yeah so ladies i hope that you're well 
we're actually next year but you should be watching this video in the new year <laughs> now that i think about it you should be watching this video in the new year so next year for me but th this year for you so i'm just going to add some uh, glue here now and i'm going to try and do both together how's that for you uh, oh. got no time to even clean my glue here just like bunching up i'm not sure why not you know not allowing me to move freely through this Right, so this one goes here. I'm gonna add this one to this side. Yeah, like that. And it's so crooked. What was I thinking? Right, so that's going to go there. Just gonna add some more glue here and do that, okay. And then I'm just going to make sure that this glue has gone to the ends of the paper as well okay like that then the next one i'm going to do is this one here turn it over because it seems like my glue never gets to the end um sometimes and i'm like irritated now because you know you put it everywhere and it doesn't go everywhere oh it is what it is hey so trying to put as much glue as possible And it's very difficult because this glue is giving me a hard time. But I have to use it because it will, you know, be working with uh, cereal boxes here. And you need a stronger glue for cereal boxes, hey? Yeah, so that's done there. Now I pressed it too much and it's going to uh, like just weep out. Okay, so ladies, I hope that you are well and that the new year is treating you well i'm going to apologize in advance um this week when you're watching this you're going to probably get the video on the monday or the wednesday because the monday is yeah i'm gonna get it on the monday or the wednesday and then you're going to get um see all this Just, um, came out so I've got some window cleaner in here uh, it's too sticky for me not to wipe it out so excuse me I'm so sorry about this but otherwise everything's gonna stick onto my project okay so that's done yeah All right so now we need to just cut it down to size I don't know what's happening <laughs> right like that and then like this oh. yeah so the reason why you're not going to get three videos you'll get your friday free beats already filmed uh it's because i am um, i need to go and complete my packing I haven't completed my packing as yet and we are leaving tomorrow morning so Harry's just came home from work now and he just went to the shop to make sure that we have enough food for our dog uh, who's going to be at home uh, well we have uh, uh, our helper taking care of her and she's going to be <laughs> she's she's going to be sleeping uh, in in, in, in like the granny cottage kitchen uh, because uh, because the house is going to be closed so but she's slept there before as well uh, yep so just sorting her out we bought her the dry chunks yesterday but my 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 doggy is a bit spoiled she doesn't like eating she wants home cooked food mm -hmm. yes 
Miss Miss Queen. Sorry, I'm just looking at what's the right side over here. And <laughs> I don't know if I told you this. So, <laughs> so she has a bed in the lounge because she sleeps inside. She's a pretty, not a very, like a medium sized dog. She's a cross between a Sharpie and a Labrador. And then um, she sleeps inside. And then what she does is because it's so hot these days, uh, she does not want to sleep in the lounge. Uh, she's got a little corner in the lounge, but she doesn't want to sleep in the lounge. Uh, but, um, and the reason why we keep her in the lounge, because uh, it's, um, it's the closest to all the rooms. Yeah, so the TV room and stuff like that is on the other side. So we don't want her to feel lonely. So we keep her in the lounge, but she doesn't sleep in the lounge. She hops from room to room, depending on where the aircon is on for the night. Because she feels so hot. <laughs> so we call her the room hopper. Uh, and then she'll hop to this room and then sleep over there. And then hop to the next room and sleep over there. Uh, depending, you know, because the aircons go on in the bedrooms at different parts of the night. Uh, depending who's feeling hot where in which room so she if you if like in our room if the aircon is off and then she'll hop to one of the sun my son's rooms <laughs> wherever the aircon is on it is so funny we wake up in the morning i think i told you guys this and we're like where did where, where did she spend the most time whose room did she spend the most time in i love her she's adorable she had a bad year uh, this, well, you think you're listening to this video in 2024, but in 2023 she had a bad year health wise. But she's good now, she's good and she is on the mend. I think you must have heard me talking about it in my videos. Sorry, just inking here quickly. I had to ink now uh, because obviously, you know, um, right, let's put this on. I want, uh, the reason I, I have them out is because I want to show you what I'm doing. So I'm, I'm, I'm just making a little, uh, folding it in half and then folding it in half again. So I get the center of, uh, this, uh, flower. Uh, if you can eyeball it, you don't need to fold it, but Hey, you know me, uh, I'm sure many people must be saying, is there anything that you actually do right? Because um, you film all these YouTube videos and yet whenever you speak, you say, you know me, I can't cut straight, I can't eyeball straight, whatever. Wow, guess what? That's all the reason why I film the YouTube videos to show you that if I can do this, so can you, okay? That's it. I'm going to do the other one quickly as well. Uh, like that. And then like this Yeah, Make it the middle. Yeah, so you don't, you know, that's the beauty of um, junk journals. It does not have to be perfect in the least. But uh, sometimes I think the more imperfect it is, the more organic it looks there we go that's it so now let me just put this away on this side here and uh, let me just um, how cute is that man it's so super cute I am looking for a die uh, you know a die set that has all these different uh, like uh, different shapes of whole reinforces now I know there's one but I can't remember by who, and we don't get it in South Africa. So I'm just adding this here, like that. Um, and I'm now I'm eyeballing the middle of this tag here, right? So I'm eyeballing the middle of that one, and then I'm gonna eyeball the middle of this one. Here, like this. Something like that. I love it. It is so adorable. Like that. Okay. 
then the next thing I'm going to do is I am going to start decorating over here. Uh, I think I'm going to use this one first, right, like that. And I think I'm going to put the pink with it um, like, like this, okay, something like that. So not having a lot of the pink showing, a very little of the pink showing, uh, just enough to, call, you know, add some contrast. Or color so I'm gonna put this down like that and then I'm not going to stick it down on this side like this okay I'm leaving it open there I've inked all this already just so that you know just gonna add this here now uh, I think I'm gonna turn it this this side and I'm just going to add it the like that, okay? Something like that. Oh, it stuck so well. So quick. It stuck a bit crooked. But now, if I take it out, it is going to rip. So I'm going to leave it like that. Then I'm going to take my... Um, circle i'm um, not circle not my circle not my circle i'm going to take this here okay uh this is i think i want a bigger one here i think i want a bigger one okay because i kind of want to uh, get that tag sorted there so i think i want a bigger one and i think i want to go in that direction there now what i want to do here is that before i stick the butterfly down i want to now add um this year uh, to it okay and where's my board oh uh, can you believe i lost my oh there's a it is okay so i'm just gonna put this here because i know i'm gonna use this one here i'm gonna put that there and then i am going to position this to see where it's gonna look the best so i know i want it somewhere around there now at the top of this okay and i'm also going to position it to say okay where's the middle and stuff like that and then at the top i'm going to make a hole at the top of the uh, the uh, the ball pin okay right there i'm going to make that hole and that's when i'm now going to take this a um brad and i'm going to push it in there like that right like that so it catches in there like that, okay? And then I am going to split the the legs at the the back, okay? And just move it around so that you're not having it right on the thing there. Right, so it might, it's just holding it in place. You can actually put some um, glue on it to make it um, stick well I'm just going to do it that way right and then I'm going to now I'm going to now use my much more sturdier glue uh, because then I'm going to stick those those uh, the legs of the bread down okay like that something like that okay like that and then i'm gonna put that there so so the sturdy glue is going to make sure that that doesn't move like that okay perfect then what i want to do is i want to take my buttons i've got a big button and like a smallish button now and then i just threaded some um embroidery embroidery floss on it i think before i thread i put the buttons in um let's just make our hole here now so that we can add our uh what's this word we can add our bread to it like that okay okay that looks no that looks a bit crooked I, I, I did it wrong. Okay, so I'm going to just try and adjust it a bit. 
to but yeah uh, let's see okay didn't do a very good job there Anthony sorry I'm just adding my bread in the in there and I'm just gonna do that that was a bit crooked I'm hoping that the the uh, the ribbon is gonna disguise the fact that it's not in you know completely in the center over there and then I'm gonna just take this one here just gonna add it just going to also now this is uh, I don't uh, uh, have uh, what's this word I can't get the word I don't have um, sorry silk or seam binding it's just you know what it's just too expensive to buy here in South Africa okay so I do what with that with what I have there's no way I am going to pay the price of what people sell it for over here in South Africa so uh, not at the rate I craft uh, I cannot afford it all right so we're gonna do that sorry if I wasn't in frame but all I did was I I doubled the this material right like that and uh, like this you know you know if you follow me long enough you know I cannot tie a bow and all this fluffy bits doesn't help one bit when you're tying a bow when you're bad at tying a bow the, the fluffy bits doesn't help okay do that one more time I don't know it's like there's too much of fluff yeah you know what I'm going to do I'm not going to use this piece here it's way too much of fluff on it I am going to use this piece here that has less fluff on it. How's that for you? Then I'll know what I like like that one there. That one has less fluff on it. Fluff. Do you want to call it fluff or is it um oh, what is it? It's it's frayed. And the material frays like that. It's a very pretty edge for sure, but it's just not working for this bow. Someone I watched said they tie their bows upside down. I can't remember who it is. If you remember, put it in the comments. Someone, someone says, I tie my bows upside down. <laughs> I have no idea. You know, you watch so many YouTube artists. You just don't remember everything that you watch. You have a little idea here and a little idea there. And that's it. Okay, so that's almost done. Uh, there all I want to do is I want to cut off another piece so I'll have it ready for the next one mm. like that and yep my desk is a mess it's because I'm crafting without uh, like season. oh that doesn't look so good okay it's fine so let's now add these buttons so I'm going to take this button also it helps because now you know exactly where this button is going to sit in terms of that bow like that I'm going to place this here trying to finish the video shame and before my hubby comes back from the shop he just came from work and then he, he came upstairs to tell me listen <laughs> Um, I need to edit this video out quite a bit because he, I had already put the, I already put, uh, put the, 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 what's the word? I, I had already pressed the record button when he came in. And then he just said, listen, going to the shop quickly to get 
the, the supplies we need. And he asked me, do you want to come? <laughs> and I was like, please, no, I don't want to see another shop for a long time. I don't want to, I don't want to. It is, it is terrible. I hate shopping. And then the funniest part is that we traveling by road and we are doing a stay over before we get to our final destination. So we're not taking all our, you know, like, nah, we're not taking all the meat stuff, just taking certain stuff because the places we are going to, uh, yeah, they have the normal shops over there and stuff like that. Uh, so, so the funniest part is, unfortunately, I'm going to have to stop at uh, the mall or the shops or whatever. And because, we, I mean, we've been to that area a few times we've been there. But still, you know, things change. Uh, and not, we're not like in the same place that we normally go to all the time. And then, uh, so, so what you gravitate towards is the malls then. And um, I was saying to him, I'm just putting this tag before I put the thing in uh, anything else because look what's happening Something. that's why I wanted to put the tag on first right so I'm gonna leave the tag there because I don't want it to interrupt with my putting this on right so let's do this now I'm gonna put this on oh they look so pretty ladies how awesome I'm gonna use them for my Jane Austen journal which is still coming along um, it's just that I, uh, like the videos I was filming recently were all, didn't all lend themselves to Jane Austen theme. And then sometimes I want to show you something different. I don't want to only work off my journal for you. Because what if you don't have the journal? And then I want to show you that, hey, good, look at you. We can do different things. Right, I just want to put that thing in, and then I want to get this in there quickly before it settles too much because this is going at the back okay like this I think I'm gonna put it in this way yeah ah, don't settle don't settle don't settle please that okay and then there's the the one that I want to use so yeah unfortunately I'm gonna have to trick back into the mall which I hate I hate it so you may ask so how do you get your shopping done I have an awesome awesome husband he go I give him a list and over the weekend he shops for me and then he phones me and says listen this is not on your list but uh, it's on special or something do you want it and I'm like yay nay <laughs> yay nay let's move on uh, so I am so blessed never used to do it all the time but in this year he did he he took over the i mean before he couldn't even pick a tomato uh but this year he, he has he has blossomed i still do cooking okay that came out so let's put it in before we tighten now it's tighter mm, sorry Sorry if I wasn't in frame. I just needed to get it close to me to see what I was doing. <laughs> oh, these eyes are getting old. These eyes are getting old. Yeah, so. I was just going to say, I think on this one, I'm going to put some, some glue on it. I think I'm going to put, but you know what? Where do I put the glue? This one feels a little bit loose. 
So just put a tiny bit of glue there, right? And then now let's, let's using this glue. And we're nearly done. So ladies, if you enjoyed this project, do consider giving it a thumbs up and um, a comment as well. I'm just wondering. I think I'm going to put this straight. Okay, how's that? Straight like that? Yes, like that. Yeah, do consider giving it a thumbs up, as I mentioned. And then also, if you um, if you haven't as yet subscribed and you like the content that you're seeing, uh, I'd really love for you to you know, be uh, you know one of my viewers and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also... Um, don't forget, ladies, to hit that notification tab. Now, I know that I've been saying this in the last few videos. Please don't forget to hit that notification tab. Let me let, let me tell you why, okay? Why? Because, like me, I know many ladies wait to see something coming up on Facebook. And then you click on the link to the video okay but as a creator uh there are many many facebook groups that give you warning messages to say you're not allowed to post uh, a link to your youtube channel or uh, promote yourself and stuff like that then the other thing is that it does take a really long time a really long time to actually add your video to all the different Facebook groups and in that time if you know it may not seem a lot if you know you think to yourself but I mean how, how long can it take you're just posting a video okay but if you start doing the math and you look at it and say how many videos do you post a week how long does it take you to post one um, one video uh, uh, on one uh, Facebook group and then if you're posting like five videos a week and then you're posting over like uh, 20 groups, okay, that's already a hundred posts. Then if it takes like a minute a post, that's a hundred minutes. If you take that and you say, okay, if I've got a video that's 30 minutes long, that's three, three and more videos uh, that I could have been doing in that time. I do post, but I was hoping that I could encourage you to actually, uh, you know, subscribe and then hit that notification tab so that I can listen the posts over time this year. That is one of my um, my goals is to try and encourage my viewers to do it that way, uh, to help me so that I can bring, um, you know, longer video, uh, not longer, more videos. Hey, how's that? Isn't this just adorable? I love it. I, I absolutely love the flower over there. I must say, um, I was considering not doing the flower. But I'm so glad I did the flower because I don't know, just add something to it. Just add something to it. That's another one. Okay. And that's the final one. I don't know. Did I do that first? I think I did that off camera. So that's that one. Thanks so much, ladies. I do hope that you have an absolutely awesome um, week. As I mentioned, I <laughs> I'm posting so many videos that, um, or filming so many videos, I can't really say when this is going to go up. Um, and yeah, try it. Give it a try. Thank you, and have a blessed week ahead. Until I see you again. Uh, bye bye and take care. Lots of love from me, Santani at Sunny Creates. Bye bye.